It's that time of the year again. Amazon Prime Day, the biggest online shopping event of the year, is just around the corner and the excitement is palpable. Last year, Amazon raked in an incredible $12 billion in revenue during this event, highlighting just how crucial it is for Amazon sellers. Now, the big question is, how can you get your store and deals ready for Amazon Prime Day 2023? Hello everyone, I'm Ankita Patil, product evangelist at SellerApp and today I'm going to tell you how to prepare for Amazon Prime Day 2023. Here's a quick overview of the topics we are covering in this video. Before we begin, if you find this video helpful, click the like button below and subscribe to SellerApp so you don't miss out on more exciting Amazon selling tutorials in the future. And don't forget to follow us on our social media channels. Let's get started. If you are new to selling on Amazon and this is your first Prime Day, listen up. There are a ton of reasons why you should be excited about this event and take full advantage of it. But if you are an experienced seller and you already know the drill, feel free to skip ahead to the next part. Firstly, increase sales. Millions of customers get exclusive deals, discounts and offers during Amazon's annual Prime Day event. As a result, participating sellers can benefit from the increased sales and revenue generated during the event. Exposed to new customers, Prime Day can be an opportunity for you to expose your products to a wider audience of potential customers who may not have been familiar with your brand before. Launching new products? Now this is hands down one of the best times of the year to launch and test your new products. So if you are looking to get your brand new products out there and in front of millions of eager shoppers, now is the time to do it. Next is promoting brand loyalty, offering exclusive deals and discounts to Prime members can help you build brand loyalty and retain customer over time. Next is improved discoverability. Amazon's algorithm promotes products that perform well during the Prime Day. That means that you can see an improvement in your product's discoverability and search rankings. By taking advantage of these benefits, you can maximize your success during the Amazon Prime Day and beyond. Even though Amazon has not officially released the date for 2023, we know it is sometime in July. So I will give you all the checklists you need to ensure you are fully prepared by the time Prime Day is here. Developing an effective Amazon Prime Day strategy requires careful planning and execution. So here are some steps you can follow for a winning Prime Day. Firstly, manage your inventory levels. Now to ensure your Amazon Prime Day is a smashing success, it all starts with solid inventory planning. That's right, making sure you have the right amount of stock on hand is absolutely a key to maximizing your sales and profits during this huge event. For that, you need to replenish your FBA inventory. If you use FBA, one of the most important things you can do to prepare for Prime Day, it is to replenish your inventory. With the increased demand that typically comes with this big event, you'll want to make sure you have enough stock on hand to meet customer needs. To get started, take a close look at your current inventory levels and evaluate how much more you'll need to order. Keep in mind that Amazon's inventory handling processes can be slower than usual in the lead up to Prime Day, so it's a good idea to arrange another FBA shipment sooner rather than later. It's also important to be mindful of Amazon's ASIN level quantity limits for FBA products. While you want to make sure you have enough stock to meet demand, you don't want to overstock and risk negative impacts on your account in the long run. 
So be strategic about how much inventory you order and aim to strike a balance between meeting customer needs and adhering to Amazon's policies. Next is backup FBA using FBM. Another key tactic to preparing yourself for Prime Day as an Amazon seller is to consider backing up your FBA inventory with FBM. This can be a smart move if you are concerned about running out of stock or if you are not sure how well a particular product will sell. The last thing you want is to let a product go out of stock. So during Prime Day as this can seriously impact your product ranking and hinder your sales potential. By utilizing both FBA and FBM, you'll have a backup plan in place if your FBA inventory runs low or runs out completely. With FBM, you'll be responsible for fulfilling orders yourself once your FBA inventory hits zero. This may sound like a hassle, but it can be a lifesaver in case of unexpected stockouts or other issues. And by using both FBA and FPM, you can give yourself a bit more flexibility and peace of mind when it comes to meeting customer demand during the Prime Day. Just remember that FBM does come with its own set of challenges such as handling, shipping and logistics yourself. So be sure to weigh the pros and cons before making a decision and consider testing out a combination of FBA and FPM to see what works best for your business. Next is increase your capacity. One key element of success on Prime Day is being able to handle increased demand and provide excellent customer service. To do that, it's important to consider increasing your capacity and getting more hands on deck. With Prime Day set to be bigger than ever, it's crucial to save enough staff to handle customer inquiries, process orders and ensure timely delivery. This may mean hiring temporary staff or bringing an extra help to support your existing team. Many physical retailers hire seasonal staff to cope with the busy holiday period and the same principle applies to online retailers during Prime Day. By increasing your capacity and having more people available to handle orders and customer service inquiries, you can ensure that your customers have a positive experience and more likely to become repeat customers in the future. Second is audit your listings. To ensure a smooth prime day, it's crucial to ensure your product listings are up to date and optimized. Missing out on crucial information can make it difficult to manage your listings on the big day and customers may quickly look for alternatives if they don't find what they expected. Therefore, it is important to audit your listings and fill in any gaps to avoid losing potential customers. Take the time to review and optimize all aspects of your listings, including the title, images, bullet points, descriptions, and more. If you have a brand registry on Amazon, you can even use the split testing feature to test if your content is A plus or not. This way, you can ensure your listings stand out and attract customers on Prime Day. Third is budget management. It's always good to think ahead and consider budgeting for Prime Day. Budget management is definitely an important aspect of maximizing your sales during the Prime Day. Allocating your budget wisely can make a big difference in the success of your promotions and the advertising efforts. So it's a good idea to have a budget allocation plan in place both before and after the Prime Day. Before the event, you'll want to ensure that you have enough budget allocated to your advertising campaigns and promotions as well as to your inventory. After the event, You'll want to review your sales data and adjust your budget accordingly for future events. If you are curious about the performance of Amazon Prime Day 2022, let me show you an interesting detailed report. After logging into the Seller App dashboard, go to the Report Central. This will give you comprehensive analysis, which includes exclusive insights on buyer order spend, trend reports by category, sponsored advertising highlights, and much more. You'll get all the information you need to understand the key trends and insights from the event, helping you to optimize your strategies for the next one. 
Also, day partying can be a great strategy to use during the Prime Day event. By analyzing your sales data from the previous years, you can determine uh, what are the peak hours when customers are most likely to make the purchase and adjust your budget allocation accordingly. You can actually make things easier on yourself by using the Celera platform. One great feature of this platform is that you can have your rules reviewed by experts which can help you fine-tune your budget strategy and get better results. Now let me show you three simple steps to creating day parting rules on Seller App's advertising dashboard. Go to Automation, Automation Blueprint and Budget Management. Then create a blank day parting rule. In the first step, choose account level or campaign level. I'm choosing campaign level, sponsored products, all campaigns. Next, the earliest start date will be tomorrow's date and the end date I'm choosing as 12th of May. Now, do you want to override the budget for the selected campaigns? If you select it as yes, then you need to enter in daily budget that will be applicable for all the campaigns from the start date to the end date. If you select it as no, Whatever budget you have already allocated for all campaigns, that will be it from the start date to the end date. Next, select time. It usually starts at midnight and the budget will be the absolute value. You can also add more time over here. And now you are all set to review and enable your day parting rule. This will help you to optimize your budget utilization and reduce the wasted ad spending on your campaigns. Now, this can help you maximize your ROI by ensuring that your budget is being used effectively during the most important times of the day. Fourth, take advantage of Seller Fulfill Prime. Now, if you are gearing up for Amazon Prime Day, one of the best ways to maximize your sales during this event is to take advantage of the Seller Fulfill Prime program. Now, this program allows sellers to ship orders directly to local Prime customers from their own warehouse. It is similar to Fulfillment by Amazon program, but it also helps out Fulfillment by Merchant sellers as well. By using SFP, you can deliver your products within two days of your domestic uh, Prime customers by displaying a Prime badge. The best part of the SFP program is that you don't have to pay any upfront charges in order to use this program and it's easy to join the waiting list. So if you are an FBS seller, you can take advantage of SFP to complete orders from local Prime customers within your region. By using a third-party carrier service to deliver products directly from your warehouse, you can save your FBA inventory from being out of stock. Now, SFP is a great option for sellers who want to ensure timely delivery of their products during the Prime Day without having to rely solely on FBA. By participating in SFP, you can reach more Prime customers, increase your sales and boost your overall visibility on the Amazon platform. Fifth is offer multiple ways to save. As Prime Day is the biggest shopping event of the year, shoppers expect massive discounts and deals. As a seller, reaping Prime Day benefits of profits start way before the Prime Day with the offers. So there are a few options you can try to offer multiple ways to save on this big day. One strategy you can use is to create and distribute coupons to your customers, giving them early access to your inventory. Now, this is especially useful for items that have been sitting in your warehouse for a while or have a low turnover rate. So by offering early access, you can generate more sales and reduce the amount of inventory you have to hold on to during the Prime Day rush. You can generate coupons for your products within your Seller Central account. Amazon charges $0.6 for each coupon and it will show up in a bright green tag right next to your listed price when a customer visits your product page. Another option is to offer lightning deals, which is a limited time promotion offered by sellers. Now, FBA sellers can apply for lightning deals by flashing the number of items they have left in their inventory. So for example, you can set a tag as hurry up only 60 items left or set a timer for the deal. 
these deals instantly grab the attention of customers and encourage them to make a quick purchase. Finally, you can adjust your listing price to lower your prices directly from your listing. Although Amazon doesn't recommend uh, lowering your prices, you can do so on big sales day like Prime Day or Black Friday to attract more customers. Six, target your competitors' keywords and products effectively. Now, targeting your competitors' keywords and products can be a great strategy for Prime Day by keeping an eye on the CPC that is cost per click, you can make sure you're getting a decent return on ad spend. It's an important uh, task to track their prices and inventory levels so you can find the opportunities to capture their sales. Don't be afraid to get creative with your targeting and messaging to set yourself apart from the competition. Seventh is level up your marketing game. If you want to make sure your products stand out on Amazon, Prime Day, it's essential to level up your marketing game. In addition to optimizing your listings, you need to make sure customers find them both on and off Amazon. Now, here are some effective marketing strategies you can use to attract customers and increase sales. Set up PPC campaigns. Now, aggressive bidding can help increase sales velocity and drive traffic to product listings, which in turn can lead to improved organic ranking on Amazon. You can bid aggressively on the keywords related to your products to increase your organic ranking for those keywords. This process takes time, so start early to ensure your listings are optimized in time for Prime Day. To off Amazon advertising, consider advertising your products on other social platforms like Google, Facebook. You can use these platforms to advertise your highlighted products on Facebook blog articles and other websites as well. Use influencer marketing, collaborate with influencers on various social media platforms and ask them to promote your products before the Prime Day. This will help you to boost your sales on the day of the event. By utilizing these marketing strategies, you can ensure that your listings are easily discoverable and the customers are aware of the great deals you're offering on Amazon Prime Day. Eighth, get as many reviews as you can. If you want to maximize your sales on Amazon Prime Day, it's important to get as many positive reviews as possible. If you are looking to improve your product reviews on day uh, Prime Day, why not try using Amazon Wine program? This program allows sellers to offer their products to a group of Amazon Wine reviewers who are chosen based on their writing and reviewing history. By doing so, you can get more honest and unbiased reviews of your products from a wider range of customers. These reviews can then help you to improve your product's ranking and attract more buyers on Prime Day. To make sure you are fully prepared for Prime Day, take advantage of the advanced stats and metrics such as units sold, average order value, revenue, etc. offered in Amazon Seller Central. These tools allow you to track your sales in real time so you can adjust your strategies as needed to maximize your success on the big day. Ninth is monitor and optimize campaign performance in real time. Now, to make the most of your Prime Day campaigns, it's crucial to keep track of your performance in real time. Amazon offers several powerful tools that can help you to do just that. Here are a few examples. First is Amazon Attribution. This tool lets you measure the effectiveness of your non-Amazon marketing efforts in driving sales. For instance, if you are running ads on social media or Google, you can use Amazon Attribution to see how much traffic and sales these campaigns are generating on Amazon. Amazon Brand Lift, uh, it is in beta stage. If you want to assess the impact of your campaigns on brand awareness, this tool can come in handy. It allows you to measure the lift in brand metrics such as awareness, uh, consideration and preference among your target audience. Next is Amazon Marketing Cloud. For a more comprehensive view of your uh, performance metrics and customer insights, you can use Amazon Marketing Cloud. It's a powerful analytics tool that lets you 
track your Amazon advertising campaigns across multiple channels and devices. By leveraging these tools, you can get real-time insights into your campaign's performance, identify areas that need improvement, and make data-driven decisions to optimize your strategy for better results. Now, Amazon Prime Day is a golden opportunity for e-commerce brands to boost their sales, increase brand visibility, and reach new customers. By following these nine essential tips, you can ensure that your brand stands out and maximizes its Prime Day success. Don't miss out on this massive shopping event. Start preparing now to make the most of Prime Day 2023. And that's it for this video, everyone. Thank you so much for watching. Your support means a lot to us. It encourages us to bring out more helpful videos like this. If you found this video helpful, please like, share and subscribe to Seller App. Let us know if you guys want us to create detailed seller guides on any specific topics. You can leave your suggestions in the comment section below and we'll definitely create them for you. And don't forget to follow us on our social media channels for more helpful content. If you haven't already, click the bell icon so that you will never miss another video. And as always, happy selling!